Hi, I'm Travis Cook. I'm Matt Mueller. And I'm Jared Hatfield, and this is Tablet Tips. Today we're going to be discussing the Speed School Tablet PC program, the primary base, basis of our organization. This is directed towards those future students who have been accepted to Speed School and their parents. Now, you might have just opened that letter that's saying a tablet PC is required, and... Ah, what do I do? You no. might be freaking out. Travis is going to t actually show you what a tablet is. This is a normal, regular, just plain laptop computer. But then those crazy tablet users break the screen. And bad things happen. Bad things. And then they take their pen and they jab it. But stuff shows up on the screen. That's the primary difference in a comic matter. Speed School tablet PC users can actually write on the screen just like a piece of paper. I can take this pen and even write an essay, draw a picture, put a smiley face, do whatever I want. To. A little history about the program. Myself and Travis came in in uh, 2006 when it wasn't required. However, we both elected to buy a tablet on our own. On the other hand... I came into the program where the same position you are where it was required. Now, why do I have to use this tablet? What is the benefit? Pencil and paper has been around for, I think, a few years now. Uh, it's, it's a going trend. And we're kind of uh, varying from that. So, what's the benefit? Well, your parents were probably saying the exact same things about VCR tapes. Keep that in mind. Things are always evolving, and in education, the tablet is the current newest thing that will really help you improve your educational lesson. Not only are you going to use your tablet to take notes for yourself, but many of your professors are too. When you go into that first day of calculus, you're going to walk in and there will be not one tablet. Not two tablets. But three tablets. And two teachers, but that's a different story. Yeah. That, so the education at Speed School is trying to emphasize the use of computer technology, mm -hmm. which actually helps in the case of engineering. Yeah, it's very nice to have your teacher draw something on the board, so to speak, and it appear right on your screen for you to write on top of, take notes on. It's great. It's wonderful. Also, you can highlight it on PowerPoint slides. Yeah, it's, it's really great. They download the PowerPoint. It's right there. You have it. And yeah. Dino, which yeah. I mentioned, it was an earlier tablet tip, and it'll probably be future tablet tips as used by many professors as well. Yeah. On that note, a lot of the things we're going to be talking about were not going very in-depth. Check out current and past tablet tips to get more information on Our it. website, I'm going to put it right at the bottom there. It's right you there. Can, so if you're not at Stug's website, definitely visit Stug's website. Excellent resource. Or will be. Will be. It is. So. <laughs> <laughs> now, the tablet PC program may seem intimidating at first, but it really is something new, and especially for engineers, you're learning some valuable computer skills. And you don't have to be a millionaire to buy a tablet. They're very affordable. Just... Check out tablet tips and a few other resources before you, you buy your tablet. You might not want to go into Best Buy and buy their only tablet on the shelf. You really should invest in research and make the decision. You're going to be in college for a few years. You don't want to... Yeah, a lot if you're in space school. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jared Hatfield. Thanks for watching Tablet Tips.